Hello and welcome back to the channel if you were with before, or welcome to the channel if this is your first time. This is Lee Allen Presents. I am one of your hosts. I am Alan. This is the other host. This is Leanne. Uh, or rather, I should say, I am Legolas, and this is Gimli. And if you haven't already discerned by now from the title card and those names, we are back with another installment of Journeys in Middle-Earth. Um, I believe this is episode nine um, of our Bonds of Arnor series. Yes. Um, this is obviously the board game by Fantasy Flight Games, I believe they are. Uh, yeah, yeah, Fantasy Flight. <laughs> um, <laughs> too many games. So, this is, uh, like, like most of the games we sort of play or host on our channel, this is a... Uh, narrative driven uh, 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 game so if you haven't seen the other eight uh, particular chapters in this um, playthrough then we will whack a link somewhere on the screen about now for you to be able to go back and check those out and catch up with us and then rejoin us here um, for chapter nine which is titled the mirror of spirits um, Leanne do you want to give us the skinny on this particular one ah, okay <clears throat> let me just set my glasses properly mm. the mirror of spirits within the ruins of a numinous lies oh gosh Nalti Naltiala yeah why not Naltiala <laughs> sorry a mirror said to allow the user to communicate with the dead and the last component of Atarin's plot against the people of Eriador the wraiths you have encountered thus far are likely just the beginning of your trials here the next adventure will be a journey map. Warning! Losing this adventure will end the campaign! I just saw that and I was like, wait, what? Uh... As you might know, uh, I haven't pre-read <laughs> this, so help. Uh, this may be our last episode. <laughs> of this particular uh, campaign, yes. But up to now, it's like if you lose, it sort of just changes. Yeah, but I guess there has the to be path. a point where it's going to be like, right, okay. Here yeah, we go. so I guess we're going to go. <clears throat> um, quick sidebar there may be some noise coming from outside. It is ridiculously warm today, so we have our door of our, of our gaming room open. Um, so if there is seagulls or, or car noise, it's because. That door's open there. Um, also, I hope I'm not being washed out because of the light as well. So we'll see. We'll we got see. Got lighting issues. We got warmth issues. All sorts. Sound issues, maybe, possibly. <laughs> we'll see. Anyway, let's go. Let's continue. So confirm. confirm. Yes. Let's save and quit. Back out. No. Ah. No. Okay. Okay. So um, we're at the campfire sort of stage. Yeah. So I think we've got experience, but I don't know if you looked at this at the end of the last one or not. I think we, we did, but some... yeah, do you want to look at yours first? So yeah. if I click on Gimli now, um, um, there you go. I think I was saving up for that final defense oh, 12, Oh, yes, but if this is going to be the, well, it might not be the last one, that's the thing, so. Yeah, Are you going to? What this is, oh no, I have to look at the cards, don't I? You've un, now. yeah, no, no, so oh, no, you've, take it off. that's the one oh, you already have. Good. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Gotcha. Um, is it worth looking? It has been a little while, so... <laughs> okay, I have to find... Final defense. Um, um, what's my role, guardian? There may be some fast sorting in this video, kids. <laughs> uh, alright. Made a choice. I'm gonna get voice like ringing steel, which costs seven experience. <laughs> and the skill is when a nearby enemy activates, you may discard this skill to be the target and scout one. You cannot suffer fear during this activation, so I might be able to leap to your defense. No, you do still have three XP in you. There is three skills with three XP. Oh, Did you want to look at those or? I think I'll leave them for now. Okay, that's fine. Too many new things at once scares okay, me. So. Okay, what's this on the hunt skill for me then? On the, on the hunter. Cool. So, oh, they've both got um, inspiration as well, so that's cool. So, I'm going for two skills because I have 14 XP. There's two 7 XP skills. So, first, I'm going for Falcon Companion, which is a creature. During your turn, you may discard the skill to apply three hits and pierce a nearby enemy and or sprint one. Or, but then this, this doesn't say or, so I'm guessing I can sprint as well. Well, um, so sprint one, you discard the card with sprint to do the sprint thing to add add to your movement. So the other one is um, discarding it to apply hits. Yeah. So I think it's set. So I guess I can run in and hit, and then it would add the, the, the three hits to it. Because with this one, Deathstroke, 
before you strike with this skill, add lethal to the attack and then strike two. So I'm doing everything mm -hmm. on the card, not one or the other. But that's because um, that bit where it says before you strike with this card, add half, that doesn't say you may discard this to do that. That's directly related to that strike. But this, strike, sprint one specifically says you can discard a card that has it to add additional movement. Yeah, that feels weird. And the other bit has. It feels weird. They should have put a line there if that is the case. Mm. Okay. Can Ellis house rule it, see okay. how it goes. <clears throat> All right, we happy? Yeah. Okay, continue. Oh. <laughs> can you reach from there or you're, can you not? Not very easily. Um, and back. Let's go. Woof, woof, woof. Oh. So if you said now bark, sorry. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. You enter Great Anuminas on the southern shores of Lake Evendim. Evendim? Evendim. Evendim. <laughs> Once the capital of the kings of Arnor, the city has lain an abandoned ruin for more than 1,000 years. Thunder rolls in the distance, and light rain welcomes you to this haunted place. So we get tile 301B. Oh, here we go. Here we go, folks. Oh, one. B? Is that the B side? That's A side. There is. That way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Next. <clears throat> Somewhere in the city rests. Meltala? Meltala. The mirror of spirits, a tool used in ancient Arnor to communicate with unseen spirits. The possessor of. Mel Tiala commands respect from the dead, and with it, Atarin could raise his fell army with little effort. You must find it first. Place heroes as indicated in Scout 3. So, should we just call it the Mirror of Spirits instead? Yeah, let's, we're going to go Mirror of Spirits because otherwise <laughs> we're going to be here forever. Scout 3. So, we get one, draw 3 two, and then three. select 1 to prepare. Yep. And the others can either go <laughs> on top or on the bottom. got a title mixed in with my uh, uh, things. No, no it is one, because it's got a... Oh, yeah, no, yeah, I've got, got the same, yeah, it's funny. My bad. Um, hmm. I think I'm going to do a light-footed. When you interact with a search or threat token before you test, you may discard this skill to test agility and scout instead and scout one, or I can use it to sprint one. Um, okay. So I'm going to equip that one. I'm going to have... Uh, these two on the Ready bottom. defense. When you test and negate um, a wound or fear, add one success. And it's also got guard two, so I can help you out um, potentially. Put things in a weird place. I yeah, know. well, it's just fine as long as you know what they are. This fine. <coughs> this is fine. Okay, let's continue. Okay, three twenty A. Three twenty. So this is probably going to move this way. <laughs> this is Here we go. <clears throat> 20. That's B. Flip it. Okay, so is it there? Looks like it's there. Can you shift it? Yeah, that's yeah, there. No. No. Wait. That's it. There. there. Yeah. Ooh, okay. Continue. <laughs> Two Two oh five A. Two oh five A. <clears throat> Five A. Oh. Oh. Uh, continue. Two hundred oh. B. Why to put the pile down? Hundred. Hundred. B. Oh wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You got it. I just could not get my head around that all the time. Okay, search right. tokens, exploration tokens rather. Three. So one there, one there, one here. Picked up four, <laughs> of course. Okay. Cool. Continue. 
You see an enormous <laughs> tower dominating the view of the Numinous proper. Such a monument <laughs> would have held the chambers of the King of Arnor and his most valuable advisors and artifacts. Hmm. The four pile is smaller. This is fine. I was wondering how big this map's going to get. <laughs> bigger than the table, probably. Uh, 400. The board's like, I am the table. <laughs> uh, that way. There. Still good? Still good. I think so. I'm going to guess that needs an export. 206B. 206. Two, oh, six, B. Right, we might have to do this one. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. Continue. Ugh. Two, exploration, <laughs> tokens. I'm going to quickly adjust the light because I can't see the board. Ah. <laughs> The next question again. Yep. You should head deeper into the city to begin your search. Objective updated. Find the mirror of spirits. <laughs> your passage <coughs> through the gates lets you enter the city ahead of the Taran's soldiers, but you know your lead will not last long. I think last time we like convinced some people <laughs> to let us in. Yeah, they were race uh, spirits. Oh, okie dokie. Action phase. So if I remember rightly, you scout two. Um, at the beginning of each action phase. That's during the rally phase. Oh, the rally, which okay. Which is at the end. So okay. each hero takes a turn by performing two actions, <laughs> and then we move on. So that is obviously the city here. So I'm guessing we're going to go and look in there. Yeah. No, it's, it's interesting this outcropping bit, where that if that might be anything useful. <clears throat> Or if we just head straight in, because we know time has a yeah, that's the thing of it. Real now, isn't it? effect. So. Is the first thing we have to do is explore this tile anyway. Yeah. Well, I mean, you could, I could, oh, let's say for example, I was to move. You move two um, things per per move action. So I could do one, two, and explore both of those, and then one, two. So I can um, do an explore on that. Yes. Because you automatically explore a tile when you walk into it, I believe. I think so. <clears throat> so, am I going first? Are you going first? I don't mind. Okay. One, two. So let's do this one first. Yeah. So you get a one of these. Let's, let's, let's not jump ahead of ourselves. The remains of a battlefield are scattered <coughs> in this area. Broken spears and flags too, too old to identify. Discard the exploration token, gain one inspiration. Okay. So that's there. Where are those tokens? Ah. Down the back of the field ones, or the, or the people? These, these. Um, a tattered bundle of rag and bone. Ooh. Slumps <laughs> at the side of the trail. Place a search token as indicated. Just wrecking the entire board yeah. now. Okay. So are you definitely sure you want to keep moving? I think so. I don't think we can waste time. Okay. A book with cracked and aged binding is lying on the ground. Place a search token there. The thing is, like, some of these things might be useful. To... Yeah. So that was a book. This one was a bundle of rags. Yeah. Rag okay. and bone. Yeah. So I'm going to carry on moving through anyway. Okay. And I might as well explore this one. Let's <laughs> check in something. Uh oh. <laughs> Inspiration. Just want to double check it doesn't end your movement. You can split. Exploring a tile does not require the hero to end the movement. <laughs> it could split your movement across things, I think. Wind brushes over the grass, making the wood of an old gibbet creak ominously. Discard the exploration token, gain one inspiration. A child sized figure huddles up under a tattered cloak, miserable and lonely. Place a threat token. A tall man with broad hat oh. leans on a broken fence. Place a person <laughs> token. Yeah. Your journey continues. Okay, so I've only used one action so far. Yes. So now I can either carry on moving 
or I can try and interact with one of, with, with the person on the the the, the square I'm on. Let's call it a square. It's not a square, but let's call it a square. Um, I want to do some interaction. I mean, like there might be benefits <clears> here <throat> that we'll miss out on if we go through too. And just obviously, it's timing now, isn't it? That's the thing about it. So, okay, so I've interacted with this guy. Okay. The man turns as you approach and doffs his hat. Begging your pardon, he says. Duggan is my name. Summit has broken my fence and all my critters are loose. Could I trouble you to look for them? I'd be grateful. Mm-hmm. So you can either say, of course you have my word, or I make no promises. Well, I feel like I don't want to be a dick, do I? So. <coughs> the man solemnly looks at oh, you no. up and down, then offers his hand to shake. So your test one test spirit meaning one success now i can use an inspiration to change one of these to a success yeah so i'm gonna do that okay so you pass i feel better knowing a noble soul like you like your good self is looking out for me the farmer's hand is warm and solid in your own again what inspiration cool okay sweet Well, that was not a climatic. <coughs> okay, so my turn? Yeah. So should I try and explore one of these things to see what if, if you want. anything helpful? I'm um, just kind of worried about this this undead army of spirits, or un- I say undead army of spirits, you know what I mean? To me, it sounded like we had a bit of a head start with... Yeah, but head um, starts only last so long. It just feels a bit like if we just charge through, we're like missing a lot yeah. of content. <laughs> and there's interesting things happening. But then last times we have failed this is because we spent too long looking at the interesting things. <laughs> the one time we failed because we looked at the wrong interesting things. Yeah, that's what I mean. But we looked at, yeah, no, we were meant to look at interesting things, just not the same ones that we did. I don't know, what do you think? You seem to think you should... Well, you're playing your own character. I can't dictate your moods. You're playing your own person, so you need to make your own choices. Well, you seem to be swayed by my, my answers, so I don't know. Okay, I'll explore the book. <laughs> No, wait. My wisdom's not great. Maybe I'll expose a bone in rags instead. Yeah, I'll do that. So I move. You I'm can, moving. if you do this, you can move afterwards because mm-hmm. you can split your movement anyway, so. The body of a lost traveller has lain here for some time, forgotten and unmourned. Stained bandages hang slack around the withered form and they clutch a journal to their chest. Perhaps it contains some knowledge of who this person was and how they came to perish here alone. Read the journal. The lost soul was on was on what they described as a great quest with two faithful companions. Beset by foes and plagued with mixed misfortune, the fellowship faltered and they were separated far from home. Wounded and doomed, this would be this would be hero's last recorded thought was for the safety of their absent comrades. Test spirit. Four spirit. Um, one, two, three. Or one success. Um, I can't do anything about that. So I fail. Okay. It is impossible to not to see yourself reflected in this fallen hero. What ill fortune or misplaced step on your own quest could lead you to a similar ignominious, ignominious end? What ruthless foe lies in wait for you with bared blade and cool heart? Will your own friends save you, or will they too fail? You quail at the enormity of the task before you and dread the coming trials. Become despondent and discard the search token. Okay, where is despondency? I'm not going to say it. (laughs) Hey, that was just really bad luck. Is it these? Weakness? No, it must be in... Somewhere else. But look, yeah, we've looked through the book, can't find anything about being despondent, so I'm just going to add the <laughs> distracted weakness to my deck, so it'll just make it less likely to get successes. Um, and then I guess I'll do my second movement into there. Okay. Uh, two. Okay. 
Okay. And action phase confirmed. Yes. <clears throat> shadow phase. The shadow deepens, though hope yet endures. Threat increases by eight. That's the other thing, getting rid of stuff is it lessens how much it goes up by. I know. Each hero resets their deck. And scouts two. I just got really unlucky with that draw. It's at four. And then you got the one. What can you do? That's the second time I've pulled that one. <laughs> okay, and it's already that one. Pulled the new one. Yeah, me too. It's about enemies, <laughs> so I don't know whether it's worth. Um, <laughs> We're going to get enemies at some point. You can have four things equipped. Yeah. So, um, I'm going for Falcon Companion. During your turn, may, you may discard this skill to apply three hits and pierce to a nearby enemy. Okay. So or I, I can sprint one. Voice like a ringing steel. When a nearby enemy activates, you may discard this skill to be the target and scout one. You cannot suffer fear during this activation. Okay, I think if Gimli goes first and searches that threat in case it's uh, an enemy, because okay. you've got better um, uh, might. Sounds good. And then I've got, I can shoot from far off. I can I can sort of hit from here if it comes to it. Alright, let's do it. Do, do, do. Yeah, that one. <coughs> a child under a tattered cloak shivers in the elements, weeping softly. I'm going to offer to help. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind, bye. <clears throat> You crouch low to speak to the child and are surprised to see a broad, gap toothed smile leer at you from the weathered, scarred face. Sorry about this, mate. Sneers mm. the mean looking hobbit what? before he gives you a sharp, gives a sharp whistle <laughs> to signal his lurking compatriots. Easy for you to say. Use one of your equipped items and test one of it using one of its stats. This is not an attack test. Input the number of successes. If there is a nearby hero, which you are because you're adjacent, I'm on the same right? tile, yeah. Um, add one success. So okay. items is this one, which is my axe, <laughs> which is a might test, which I have four. One, two, three. Oh, good none. Can I have something about if you get none? I think that's on a card. I think it's on somewhere. a skill, isn't it? Double check anyway. But is there anything in your um, your trinkets? Nope. That's about scouting. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, <coughs> I guess it's one. <laughs> 17 hobbits bum rush you. Um, Despite the advantages <coughs> of surprise and superior numbers, your assailants can't speak today. Your assailants are unable to best you. You fight them off with tenacity and resolve, though their stout cudgels land heavy upon you. Suffer two face down wounds and remove the threat token. So that's Yikes. fun. Uh, wounds. Damage cards. Yeah. Two of those face down. Um, and when I suffer wounds, after resolving all wounds from a single source, gain one inspiration. There's that. And I will, I guess, I've got one movement left. Yeah. Should I just move in? And yes, might as well. Boop. <clears throat> Even partially collapsed, the King's Tower still stands as the ground grandest structure in Illuminus. In better days, it held Arnold's most valuable treasures. It is as good a place to, as any to start your search. Gain one inspiration. There's a goat on top of this roof. It probably doesn't belong there. Place a search token as indicated. Well, there's your... Uh, what your friend's looking for. Uh. <clears throat> this tower once stood high above Anuminous, but the years have reduced it to bare and crumbling stone. There's another search token. Where I am. Yellow flowers surround an old stone well. Another search token. Mm -hmm. Search on everything. Mm -hmm. um, the freshly chewed corpse of an animal lies on the ground here, and that's a threat token. <coughs> Your journey continues. Do I have to discard the sprint? I can't remember. I think I do, don't I? Yeah. Sprint. You can discard a card that has Sprint X keyword to move up to X additional spaces. 
Okay, I'm gonna discard my Falcon Companion to sprint for one. Then I'm gonna move two. I'm gonna interact with this goat. Get the goat! So I get the feeling this old man might be able to help us. This this one will help mm. me down here. There's a goat <coughs> on the roof. It probably doesn't belong there. Search. The goat bleats at you, then goes back to chewing its cud. <laughs> Test wit. We need two to pass. <laughs> two is very difficult. We really need to get this goat. Yikes, where are all my successes, honestly? Whoops, I just pulled up my phone. <laughs> Dang it. The goat leaps gracefully into your arms, knocking you both sprawling. Then it dances away, tail flicking. You can only hope it's headed back to where it belongs. <laughs> Flick one wound face up, but you don't have any. Nope. Gain one inspiration, then discard the search token. Cool. Okay. <laughs> Hang on, I haven't had my turn yet. Yeah, you have. You move first. Did I? Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> my bad. <coughs> Try increases by seven. All right. As the storm draws nearer, a Taran's orc spread throughout the city. They, the overland route you took into the city now swarms with them, <coughs> and your time to find na- the narrow spirits is rapidly dwindling. Do I need to start reading these? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, here we go. Oh! Fell beast. What's one of those? It's in the bag. Uh, it should be in there. It's the one with the wings. Probably it's a dragon, effectively. It's the, the wraiths. This guy. Oh my god, what the hell. Okay. And now I have no way to get back to the guy with the goat. Rally face. I'm not going to say it, but I told you so. We wouldn't have been that much for the rest. <laughs> This one again! Every time I've scouted, I've pulled this card. <clears throat> What's my weakest out of those? I'm gonna pick Ancient Wisdom. When you test Wisdom, you may discard the skill to add one success. I'm gonna do Stalk Prey. When you attack, if there are no nearby heroes, add two hits, and there's a hide option on those as well. Um, just because the luck wearer one just doesn't seem to look like it, it would do much for me. Okay. Um, okay. Let's go. Gimli, where are you going? <laughs> so do we want to try and deal with this? Can you click on it and see what we're dealing with? Eight damage and there's two pink, I think it's magic, magic armor. Magic armor probably. Oops. Um, yeah, it doesn't say what. That is. Fun noises. Um, so I imagine they restore after everyone. So either we could try and take it. Um, You're the one with the most sort of damage in in that sense. Like I could probably do a lot, but yeah. I need to get closer. I mean, obviously you do as well, but you know what Thank I mean. You. What's my? What is the range of, of range? Is it just the one, or is it? Can go, I think it's hmm. adjacent. Um, let me have a look. Okay, so for a melee attack, it's the same space. Yeah. For a ranged attack, it's the same or adjacent. Okay. Yeah, I thought it was. Okay. What do you think? Is it worth trying to take this out or just try and move forward? It's probably going to kick up that threat track quite badly, isn't it? Let's probably. Be honest. Okay. So I will move. Yep. <laughs> and then try and get it with my axe. What are you going to? What are you saying? Is you're going to axe it a question? I'm axe it a question. Anything I can do. So I've got a defense thing. Um, um, and that is also kind of defensey. So cool. One, yeah. two. There may have just been some loud banging on my mic. My beard just clicked on it. So I get one, <laughs> which would be two hits in Sunder, and I can turn that into a second one, which yep. makes it two hits and cleave. I think that's a good idea. Sorry, not two hits, six hits. I was going to say two hits. Different. What the hell? <laughs> so we're going to make that six so, hits. Okay. And cleave. So cleave is there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Apply. That's all I can do. <coughs> uh, yes. 
Yeesh. Okay, right. Bear with me a second. A screech of the beast is it? The screech of the beast is as terrible as its fearsome bite. Spirit to negate. I did have something about him. Let's when it activates. <clears throat> The activation is it activating now or is it i'd imagine it's reacting? a counter attack it's like a reaction isn't it? yeah okay um so this has got an ongoing thing that's ready defense when you test to negate wound or fear add one success so that's great i cool. can discard it to help you out if i need to so i've got four only for spirit. adjacent though i'd imagine one two three oh four. my god um so i do add <laughs> one success and maybe I will also use this to turn one of those into a success. I'm going to negate the two fear. Yep. And I'll take the one wound. Yep. Um, because I get something for that. <clears throat> After this attack, discard two inspiration or become terrified. Oh. Well, I'll, I've become terrified anyway. Yeah, you haven't got enough inspiration, so. So I need one damage card. Um. Yeah, it's not it was, is it, it face down or face up now? It doesn't say face, face down, so it'd be face up, wouldn't it? Oh, okay. Discard all of your boons, then flip this card face down. Yeah. I don't have any boons. So you do, yeah. So I spent that <coughs> anyway. So I become terrified, which I'll do now. I also got, when you suffer wounds, gain one inspiration. So that happens. Your inspiration is fair. Hmm? Your inspiration is upside down. Oops, it was inspiration. <laughs> So I need terrified. It's gonna be another one that isn't a card. <laughs> what are these things? This one should be in the last expansion, not the Minds of Moria one. In the books, I'm thinking about the books. So we found uh, Despondent and Terrified. They are Bane cards, which are in, do you know what expansion that is? I don't know. It's the Spreading War. Okay, Spreading War. So I've taken out the weakness card that we put in, since it's different. So Despondent, you cannot spend inspiration. Okay, that would have changed a lot, but yeah. we'll go with it. Yeah, well, yeah. nothing to do about now. <laughs> During the action phase, a nearby hero may discard two inspiration to discard this Bane. Damn. And the other one, terrified. When you attack, remove one success produced during that test. <laughs> At the end of your turn, you may discard a prepared skill to discard this bane. Okay. So it is the end of my turn. Yep. Like I could move one, but that would. You probably would trigger an attack. You just confirm on that, so it's gone. Ye yes. So I think I will discard a prepared card. Yep. The the wisdom one to yep. get rid of terrified okay now that we know what those cards are yay <laughs> i'm despondent okay my turn yes i'm going to move for one and i am in range because i am a ranged attacker mm -hmm. and i'm going to try to hit the uh the fell beast so i test with agility which is four one two three good god Oof. okay we're not having much luck today when you're... Ah, oh, there you are, a hero nearby. Okay, hold on. Is there anything I can do here? I can't kill it, that's for certain. Nope. Nope. Uh, finish, moving item, type piece of smite. In your space is not in my space. Ugh. Um. I don't you know if it's... one success. What yeah, would I do? Yeah, right, two hits. I don't know if it's worth it. How much has it got left? Four. I think. Six, technically. There's, there's, I don't think there's any point in wasting my inspiration in the thing. Okay. Because I know it's it's not going to be good for you, but I feel that I might need inspiration on the next one, because if I get one success, mm -mm. and I need inspiration to get two more, I can get five hits and cleave at that point, so I feel like I'm not going to... Okay. Can you so still I register completely an miss. attack with zero? Does if I miss... Oh, wait, maybe. Away, I don't know. Cool, but it didn't do yeah, anything because it's yeah. already That's what I thought, yeah. done a thing. Okay. Okay, so you do have one movement left if you wanted to use it. 
I don't know how this thing's gonna react. I might as well stay where I am because we don't know how it's gonna react. So. Okay. Okay. This is not going well. Ooh. Shadow deepens. Hope yet endures. Threat increases by seven. All right. It didn't do anything. <sighs> All right, Where let's... are all my successes? What if we pull that luck break, luck wearer type um, card out again now? Mm -hmm. watch. There's like a extremely slim chance I've already done it three times. Right, ready? 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 No, okay. Cool. Yeah. We're good. <clears throat> okay. I'm going to prepare precise strike. Mm, oh, both good. So that one's got a success, which I kind of gonna need at the top of my deck. So I'm gonna prepare Grim Resolve. When you are a hero in your space performs the last stand, you may discard this skill to add one <laughs> one success. <coughs> it also has guard two and rest two, which I might need to remind myself what that is. Mine strike three when you attack, discard to add three hits. Mm. Yes. Would you like me to attack first, or would you want to go first? I don't mind. Let me check what rest is. So. <coughs> Go. Oh, I don't mind. Yeah. I'm just trying to figure out if you were to take it out in one turn, I could potentially go one, two, and then look at this threat. What was this okay. threat again? What was this one? Freshly chewed corpse of an animal. So I'm just trying to maximize the time now because obviously we're, we're going to yeah. start getting on the next one. We're going to get more things most likely. So Okay, I am going to axe him then <laughs> without being able to use inspiration. <laughs> so you need to hit him for... Eight. No, six. 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 So if I get two successes, that's good. You got cleave as well, is it? Yeah, but I don't. I can't remember what that actually does. Off the top of my head. Mm. He's behind. He's can't see everything. Each enemy in the group suffers the full number of hits. Oh, okay, so it's more for so it's I, multiple people. Uh, that goes armor. Okay, I'm gonna go one, two, three, four. <coughs> so it's one. Can I do anything helpful? That's just going to be two hits. You can't turn inspiration because of the bane, can you? Yep. That's last time. Shouldn't get any good? Enemies. No, that's for um, scouting. Um, and fear. Contesting the gate. It's got guard. No, so it's just two hits. I think you can attack twice, so. Yeah. Two? Two hits. With any cleave, sunder, etc. Or... Oh, sunder. It doesn't even do anything because it's armor. <laughs> so it's going to swing back probably. Speak to the beast, etc. <coughs> Alright, so I'm casting spirit. One, two, three, four. So it's <sighs> one. Um, but I add one because of ready defense. So I negate two. Um, and that's kind of it. <coughs> So I'll negate the fear again, I'll take the one wound. Exhaustion, keep this card face up. When you scout during the rally phase, you cannot place cards back on top of your deck. Mm. Um, so I took a wound, so I gain an inspiration. Yep. And now like I can, can use discard. It. I can't use, but I can still discard. So I'll discard two inspiration. Yep. You become terrified. What did that again? rule say about... Oh yeah, no, it's a different thing. Okay. Um, is, is that despondent or terrified you still got? Despondent. So you get terrified again. I discarded two. Oh, right, okay. Is that what that was? Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> and then I you? guess I'll attack him again. Yep. <laughs> so you need to do the exact same thing again? I need... No. Because it's armor. Well, the exact same thing again won't help. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, what I mean is you to, to, to hit the exact same amount is what I meant. Oh, for one. the love of... Two. No, just one. This is hopeless. Two hits with Clay with Sunder? Yeah, it doesn't do anything now. No, I know, but we've got to play it in, so. <sighs> doesn't attack. Oh, so much for that. Okay, we might as well attack then. Uh, one, two, three, four. Oh, for the love of. Okay, hang on. <clears throat> what is happening? I'm going to spend my inspiration to make it two hits. I'm going to discard that piercing precise strike. The, when you attack, discard to add three hits. So that's five. Have I got anything? 
We've got cleave. That doesn't do anything though. Well, we should chip it down a bit more, I guess. Yeah. <clears throat> and I might as well attack again, I guess, because mm -hmm. why not, right? Then I need two successes, so. One, two, <laughs> three. I got a clue oh, for Finally. Hiya. So that's five hits with cleave. That was exhausting. That's one way to put it. Jeez. Remove one foul beast. You are a nearby hero. Gain inspiration. I'm going to gain that because yeah, you can't, can't use it anyway. It. If you uh, managed to get two and want to yeah. help me out. <laughs> End turn. Yeah. Right. Here we go. Here comes another foul beast. Oh, no. <clears throat> okay. Increased by seven. So killing the thing didn't actually change anything. <laughs> it probably would have gone up more. Taran has scouts around every corner, though you are able to dispatch them easily enough if you can catch them unawares. Carelessness costs you dearly. Three hit goblins. Okay, it's the one with the Down spears. There. Mm -hmm. These guys? Yep. <clears throat> uh, yeah. Three. Okay. I was expecting more, not gonna lie. Right, so I can't put things back on the top. No. Which is a shame. A big shame. Um. So. No, that's fine. I don't want any of those on top. Hmm. <laughs> Do you use rest at some point? Okay, I'm going to do Clever Wit. When you test Wit, you may discard the skill to add one success. When you do Tireless, at the end of your turn, you may discard this skill to perform an action you have not performed this turn. Okay. And I'm going to put that one back on top. Mm -hmm. <sighs> right. Who's was going first. What do we want to do? Do we want to try and... I'm wondering if I should go back and talk to this chap. Yeah? Let me do that first. Okay. So I'm going to move for two. And talk to this guy. Uh, so He's Farmer Duggan's mending his fence. <laughs> Here's what I found. The farmer grins, face crinkling into comfortable grooves of long use. I thank you kindly. Why don't you stay a while and share a drink with me? Flip one wound or um, fear face down if you do not gain one inspiration. Are we still there? So there's more animals. <laughs> Damn it. Okay, well, that's my turn. Okay. Damn. Um, what was this one? <clears throat> that one? Yeah. Yeah, that flowers. was an old stone well. This one? That one was the tower, which might be... <clears throat> that might be probably more likely. Yeah, I'd imagine so. And this is a red herring. I don't know. Um, okay, I'll move here and I will search the search tower. tower. You enter the tower through a lower door, mostly crumble. The once grand chamber probably gleamed in the height of Arnold's power, but now the stonework is mostly buried beneath ages of debris and dust. A winding stair leads to the upper chambers, but parts of it have <coughs> collapsed. So ascend the stairs or explore this chamber. Um, oh, I don't know where. Um, I think explore this chamber. You pace slowly about the chamber, brushing aside the years of dirt on the walls. Test wisdom. wisdom. Ugh, I got two. I got no, oh, no. This isn't going. I'm, I literally can't get three. Uh huh. So that's an immediate. Wait, hang on. <clears throat> if you would test, there is wisdom. I'll to negate. Yeah, no, I fail. There's nothing Anything on your character card? No, that's about after attacking. Oh, so pa uh, fail? Fail, I literally can't do anything. <laughs> you discover impressive murals hidden behind, beneath the grime. They depict... They depict noble warriors and kings and are beautiful to look upon, but they mean little else to you. Law increases by one. So I could move to Yeah, space, you do have one more movement. Or I can stay here and try... <laughs> Like going upstairs next time or something. I get the feeling by going upstairs they're going to crumble and your agility is not good. Well, I'll head to the well. Okay. Um. 
Let's slash it. That's the turn. Firm. <laughs> Alright, where are these guys going? Move to. Attack Legolas. And yeah, of course out. they can. On the ranged <laughs> attack. Oh, does that mean they'll be on the next. that one? I'm not sure. Um. <laughs> A goblin hurls heavy stones and debris at your head. Might negates. Negate two. So I'll take one wound. If, yeah. And then you discard one inspiration, oh. which is a, sec uh, a shame. Yeah, well, not like I can do all that. <laughs> one wound. Flip this card face down. I should have rested. <laughs> Threat increases by seven. Now I need to try and get off this square with three frigging goblins on it. Ah, what's going on? I feel this game's playing with us. I know. So how? What's what's the thing for getting off a square with enemies on it? I think it provokes them. I not, can't remember exactly. Um, start turn. I'm going to do time of need. When you test, if you do not reveal any success, you may discard the skill, give it all inspiration symbols to a success. That I'm going to do exactly the same thing. Um, but it means I have to discard one of my others because I had four. And I can't put anything at the top. So I go to the bottom, <laughs> which is a shame because it was a success. So I have a look. Right. I'm not quite sure what to look under. If a hero wishes to move out of a space that contains one or more readied enemy groups, before the hero moves they must provoke each readied enemy group. So I think there's a button when you... Oh, it might be the I button. Yeah. yeah. The stench oh. emanating from the goblins is overwhelming. Jeez. Spirit negates. Two. Great. Awesome. <laughs> you negate one. Mm -hmm. Take two fear. Oops. <clears throat> so I'll flip this card face down. Flip one face up. Flip this card face down. That's face down. Cool. So, one, one, two. And then if I try and do this tower thing. Okay. Uh, so, this is the same thing. So, you enter the tower with almost crumble. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to ascend the stairs. The stairs wind along the inner wall of the tower. Many steps are uneven from damage or fallen away completely. And the wall has toppled across the path in places. So, you can test either agility or. I will do agility. One. Two, four. Wait, 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 wait. When you test, if you do not reveal any successes, you may discard the skill to convert all of those to a success. Oh, that's four. One, two, three, four. That's the best outcome. Let's go. You climb the long stairs, passing carefully over gaps and under fallen stone until you reach an upper chamber. <laughs> there is a vacant pedestal in the middle of the room, and heavy curtains are drawn all along one curved wall. So, judging by the stale air in the chamber, you are fairly certain they do not conceal windows. This room bears further examination. Become determined. Continue. Oh. Through a gap in the tower wall, you see a numinous spread below you. Parts of the city are mere ruin, while whole districts have been reclaimed by the wilderness in the centuries since a king last ruled here. 201B. A determined card. When you test, you may discard this boon to discard any number of cards from the test to reveal that many additional cards. Hell yeah! Nice! Tidy! 2 0 1 uh, 1B. Yeah. <laughs> Where's that going there? Continue. <clears throat> 3 0 8B. Ah. Okay. 
continue. <laughs> Three zero five B. Jeez, this map's huge. It's that way and there. I think. Is that right? No, no it doesn't look right. This one. Oh yeah, 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 right, yeah. Oop. Okay. Exploration tokens. How are we meant to get around all this map, honestly? Uh, okay, I think that ended that. Yeah, your turn. Um, so I guess you could either come here and explore this or go and do the well thing. I don't know. But now we've got a problem, is it could be any of these as well. Mm. But it does say that this room needs more exploration. <clears throat> I'm wondering if I should do the well since I'm on the same square as it. Mm. And I got more sort of chance to do yeah. it if needed. Of just bear in mind the goblins are going to be coming for me next. Well, I can't get to them anyway. No, I'm just, just saying. Just... Alright, let's do the well first and see what happens. Well, there won't be anything else to do on this tile. Yeah. You won't be able to move it. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's a wooden sign next to the well that reads Throw a stone and wish for your heart's desire. Test. Wait. How much weight do you got? Two. Oh, that's the wrong cards to pick up. Yeah. So, um, one, two. Mm. I can discard Clever Wit to add one success. Yep. So I'll do that. That's a pass. You find a small white stone nearby. You hold it tightly while you make your wish. When you toss your stone into the well, you hear the satisfying plink as it hits the water below. Sorry, plunk. My bad. You feel happier. Gain one inspiration. <laughs> then discard the search token. Um, while, um... Wow, that was helpful. <laughs> so, I can either move to you ready to help there, yep. or move to... So I might take the front. It's probably not worth... It's, it, it might target me directly, because it did last time, so... Okay, I'll Just... move on your square, because I can use guard if I'm on the same square as you. Yeah. And I will also do. We're gonna hit the next the checkpoint in a second. Well. I'm gonna discard a rest two to discard um, face down damage or fear cards. All of them? Uh, two. Oh, okay. Oh, right, right, right. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Get rid of those. Get rid of that. Cool, cool, cool. So I don't know what's coming next. Ready? Yeah. Yep, move and tap me. Okay. Hello. <coughs> Yeesh. Yeesh. Spirit. Okay. I'll use guard to to discard this to prevent um to the two of the fear. Yep. On for here on my space. Yep. So, so just one fear. One. <coughs> that sucks. Uh, flip this card face down. Ten. Oh, Ten. Geez. It's because we've got three <laughs> goblins on the map. And more unexplored tokens. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So we're gonna go past that. Here comes the next bit. A boat carves a furrow oh, oh. into the lake shore, as if the orcs <laughs> aboard it are making war on Ariadne itself. Place a threat token. You can't even get down there. Out. Well, we could, but it'll take a couple of turns. You spot boats <coughs> coming into port in Lake Even Evendim. They disgorge even more of Atarin's orcs to stop you at any cost. Okay, so what we got? Giant Two spiders. Giant spiders. Oh damn dude. Uh that one. How do you get these out? <laughs> oh it's awkward placements. Yeah. Where is the gap there? One. Okay. <laughs> I don't think we're done yet. <laughs> oh look, the troll, the greatest of the beasts in a tyrant's command, bellows a challenge across the remains of the minions. Here's one hill troll, as indicated. Is he in, is he in the, the Balrog box? Mm -hmm. <laughs> is uh, the one we ran away from before? Possibly. Is that the I guess the right one, is it? His arm's different. Do a different thing. 
this one and a different one? Yeah, that's him. Just to make sure we got the right. Because that one might come into play at some point too. Long trolls. Ha <laughs> ha, yeah, okay. Right, we need a game plan now because we're going to get wrecked so hard in a minute. Okay, what do you suggest? I have no idea. <laughs> <clears throat> well, if we want to explore this room, we need to at least get rid of these goblins. So, what is their health like? Oh, we need to. <laughs> Let me click on the thing. Five hits. So if I was to get two successes, I could take all three out in one go. Okay. So if you want me to go first, that's fine. Um, <coughs> when you taste the same again. Okay. Ready defense, I think. I'm going to go for precise strike. When you attack this card, do I add three hits just in case my, my things suck? Okay. This has got, um, the bottom. when you test and negate fear or wounds, add a success, and this also got guard too. Do you want me to go first and try and take these out? Mm -hmm. Have you got cleave as well? I do. I got two successes, six hits, and cleave. Did you want to go first, then? Okay. okay. You're more likely to be able to explore, right? Yeah, probably. All right, so we're going for one, two, three, four. <laughs> Just the one. I don't think I got anything. <laughs> So it's uh, two hits and thunder instead. Yeah, <laughs> Can I yes. attack? Yeah, a little bit. A <laughs> little bit, a little bit. Okay, the goblin attacks you with dogged persistence and deadly aim. Might negates, so that's four. Oh, that's not too bad, you got might. Oh, God. I don't know what's going on. <sighs> okay, if you don't... Reveal any successes. You may discard the skill to convert all oh, nice. things. So that's three I can negate. Yep. Um, and when you test to negate, you add one success. So that would mean I yeah, get everything. Four. Yeah, that'd be four. And then yeah. I haven't got anything left to use, but I'll negate everything. Cool. Okay, and then I'll attack again. again. <laughs> I've got to have successes yeah, left the, here, the, right? yeah, Yeah, the odds are uh, with your favour now, right? One. Uh, two. Oh. Three, oh, come on. One. So it's another two hits in Sunday. I love it. There's one, one down, I guess. Ugh. <laughs> one pit goblin removed. <sighs> All right. Okay. All right. Legolas is step into the plate. Let's go. I'm going to attack. One, two, three, four. Yeesh. Okay. So I'm going to use precise strike. Mm -hmm. So I've got two success... Uh, uh, the the three hits, one success. Okay. So my one success to two hits. Mm -hmm. It doesn't include cleave. Damn it. Okay, hold on. Five hits is still pretty good. <sighs> yeah, well. <sighs> okay, I have an idea. One. I'm gonna attack again. Okay. One, two, three. Or not. Nope, that did nothing. I'm sure we never used to have this bad So, <laughs> Tyler, so at the end of your turn... Oh no, we can't, because there's an enemy on the square, right? So I can't even do anything. What's it, is that for resting? No, it's to perform an action I've not performed. So I can't even search because there's an enemy on the square, right? If a hero wishes to perform an interact action while in a space that contains one or more hero groups, you can do it, but you must provoke first. Okay. I'm going to use this tireless card. At the end of your turn, you may discard this skill. Perform an action you've not performed this turn. And I'm going to try and search or interact with the thing. So I'm going to provoke this. Oh, it's exhausted, so it doesn't even get doesn't provoked. Doesn't even provoked. Okay, cool. cool. So, yeah, search. Search. Okay. Oh, no. The chamber okay. has a vacant pedestal in the middle, a heavy curtain drawn along one curved wall. So pedestal or curtain? Move curtain to side, I think, so we can see better. They said there wasn't any windows, potentially. You move aside the curtains to reveal six tall mirrors built into the wall. Damn it. We need mirrors. We need a mirror. We're looking for a mirror. Yeah, but I've only got two spirit. <laughs> Together oh, wait. in yeah, a broad half circle. There is a place for a seventh mirror, the wall curiously bare, 
In the reflection of the chamber, you see willowy shapes moving just out of sight around you, but when you turn, you see nothing of the sort. One by one, the shapes move closer, and in the mirrors, you see dead faces crowding close to you. You hear their murmurs. The king? Is it the king? Is there a king in Arnor? Test okay. spirit. So, I've only got two spirits, so I was never going to get that, but... When you interact with the search or threat token before you test, you may discard the skill to test agility instead and scout one. Okay. So scout to the bottom. Agility. One, two, three. One. Wait, 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 wait. Mm -hmm. Determined. When you test, you may discard this boon to discard any number of cards from the test and reveal that many additionals. One, two, three. Oh. What the Where are all our I've got no more successes in this entire deck. Okay, so that's a fail. This is awful. The unnerving gaze of the ethereal host clutches at your heart, and despite all you have seen in your adventures, you cannot stave off the fear of this moment. <laughs> Suffer to fear. It's fine, I can take up the six. <clears throat> a clear voice emerges from the gathering in the mirror. What would you ask of the dead? Okay, hold on. Each other hero suffers one face down fear. Uh. Discard this card. Keep this card face up. When you attack, reveal one fewer card. Oh, that's annoying. During your turn, if you're emboldened, you may discard this card. Great. Okay, so you can either um, ask about the Mirror of Shadows, or Spirits, whatever. <laughs> ask how to protect it, or ask about the missing mirror. I guess if this spirit is asking about the king, he's looking for the king's best interest, right? So he would want to protect the mirror? Maybe. What do you think? What's, what's your thinking on this one? I think that's the one I'm drawn to as well. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Know. So I'm going to ask her to protect the mirror. <laughs> you explain the threat that Atar imposes and the dark purpose he has for the mirror. Removing the mirror is impossible without knowing the old ways of Numenor. This knowledge is lost to us, and there is no way to learn it in a Numenus, explains one ring. <laughs> we fear your foe may know something of the mirror's power, though he must have learned in a place far from Arnor. But like any mirror, the, the mirror will shatter, says another wraith, and the world has forgotten how to craft such things as this. Mm. Doing this is the only way to be sure the mirror cannot be abused. Do not forget the seventh face hidden in the vault beneath a numinous. The city's monuments hold the key. Oh, okay. The gaze of the race gives you chills and you feel compelled to step away from the mirror for now. You have found mi the mirror, but now you must decide how to prevent Atarin from possessing it himself. Objective updated. Keep it out of Atarin's hands. So I guess we're going to smash it when it's our turn. But it said something about the faces or the, the statues, yeah. so... But we found the mirror, so it's one of these, yeah. right? It has to be. Okay. So that's the end of our turns. Okay. So the spider moves, but it can't reach you because it's not long range. So I think it moves anyway. So. One, two, uh, oh. three. When instructed to move an attack, if an enemy cannot get in range of any target, it ignores the entire instruction, including the movement. So the no, no target. target button is selected, and the enemy receives a new instruction. The spider scuttles over the ground, quickly closing any distance. Moves six spaces towards the closest hero. Oh, for the love of... Wow, that's great. And same for the troll. Move 17 spaces. <laughs> Uluk charges, clawing at the ground to gain speed. Move two spaces towards the closest hero. Yeesh. 11. 11? Oh, damn. Here we go. Thunder shakes the ruins, and from the sound, you can only imagine the sky itself <laughs> is breaking. Though you are still hours from nightfall, thick clouds blot out the all light. Flashes of lightning briefly banish the shadows in the ruins, but with each flash comes fleeting glimpses of ephemeral, ghostly figures wandering there. All spaces are affected by darkness. Did we use the... You've got the torch, haven't Yeah. You? Okay, cool. More orcs pour out from their boats. Oops. Orc One orc marauder. marauder. It's got the axes, is it? 
Rex is. Uh, another guy with a club and a dagger. Uh, nope. The axe is down on his side. It may be in one of the bags. <laughs> this one? Yep. Where's that? Oh, by that way, yep. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, it's gone. Okay. I am. I don't remember having so little success cards in my deck. This is ridiculous. Don't understand. <sighs> I can't use my inspiration, and you haven't got any inspiration. Nope. We are screwed. We might lose the whole thing. <laughs> I'm gonna. When you test spirit, you may discard this skill to add one success. I'm gonna prepare that, and I'm gonna put this one back on top because it's a success. You're gonna have voice like ringing steel. When a nearby enemy activates, you may discard the skill to be the target and scout one. You cannot suffer fear during this activation. Although scouting extra doesn't help me when I can't put stuff on top. But oh well. How much health have these got? Four. No armor. Four. No special stuff. Okay. <laughs> Shall I just try and attack some things? Then? I guess. Spiders or the... What are we going to do? Mm, Have I'm you got cleave? Um, yes, if I get two successes. So that will be everything in the space, right? Yeah, yeah. I think. <clears throat> yeah, the group. Each enemy in the group. Oh, okay. So maybe spiders is the best yeah, thing to go for then. Yeah, there's two of those, not... All right, All right let's try it. One, two, three, four. Two successes, hmm. six damage, six hits and cleave. Do it. How much has the orc got left? The goblin. Goblin, sorry. Uh, five. You need five hits. Okay, so I need to <clears throat> Unless you can bust his armor up. After you perform an attack, you can place one card from the test on top. <clears throat> so I, I can guarantee myself one success. Can you do that because of your boom bane thing? Yeah, because that's just okay. about scouting. Okay. All right, let's try it. Yep. One, two, Three, four. Just the one. <clears throat> Can't do anything else. So, two hits and thunder. <laughs> That's all I can do. Yes. <clears throat> the goblin hurls hills heavy stones and debris at your head. Oh, I had that one success. I can put it back on top. Can't I? Yeah, it's back on top. <laughs> Um, might negates. One, two, three, four. I negate both. Cool. <clears throat> What's the play here? So, even if we kill this goblin, what is the play? I think we need to try and see if we can smash the mirror, right? But it says something about the seventh face. Yeah, but that that's probably around here somewhere. But do we need that before we can smash the mirror? I think if we interact and see... So if we move off the space and then have to go back, that's a whole extra thing, right? Okay. So maybe try and attack the thing once so you don't have to get... Oh wait, you won't get... Um... It's anyway, right? No, he's exhausted. One, two, three, Very nice. four. So that's five hits with cleave. I think we need, we need to just buy more skills that have success. Well, it's on. probably the last one in the campaign, so... Pick Goblin instead. <clears throat> Okay, one inspiration. inspiration. You were a nearby hero. You can't use your inspiration, right? No, I can't use inspiration. Yeah, so why don't you give it to me? So oh, I, it's me. Yeah? Yeah. Um, okay. Can I explore the thing? Yeah, um, I lost the plot then. I <clears throat> to spell my inspiration, is that a taking a can I, Do I have to use a skill to do that? To get your brain card off? During the action phase, a nearby hero may discard it to just do it, so I don't think it's. Two, right? Yeah. Thank you. And then I will... Okay. <laughs> the six pieces of mirror... Of the mirror... Um, oh, so it's seven pieces, that's why. Each taller and wider than a man are arranged in a half circle and dozens of wraiths press toward your reflection expectantly. There is a seventh hollow in the wall that appears to be meant for another large piece of mirror. So you can either speak with the wraiths, step away, or smash the mirror. But how can I smash a mirror that's not there? 
There are seven pieces of the mirror, yeah, so we'll be smashing <gasps> six of them, and we, then we just have to find the seventh okay, one, right? Okay, smash the mirror. We find a heavy oh, fragment of stone fallen from the wall long ago and strike the mirror with it. Great. Might. I've only got two in might. Sorry, I should have tried to do it myself. I've no inspiration. We strike it repeatedly, cracks, cracks spider webbing outwards, and fragments of it rain onto the stone floor. The race back away from your reflection. Become determined. If you're already determined, gain one inspiration. I am not. Okay, so determined is the one where I can redo the the, the, the sort of mm -hmm. cards and whatnot. Okay. Okay. <coughs> All right. Uh, that's my turn. <coughs> Here comes the big boy. Okay. <laughs> move can't zero. Move. Attack at you in its space. No target. No, oh, no. Okay, now he's in that space. That's that's a problem. No target. Nope. This guy. <coughs> Howling a fierce war cry, York marches towards you. Um, but we got the torch. You and other heroes in your space ignore darkness. You got to stick together. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. And now we got this troll. How much health has this guy got? The curiosity. We haven't scouted yet, but I just want to see how much he's got. Oh, oh good god! That's an awful lot. I don't know. This mirror is not destroyed yet either. I don't think we're gonna make it. You think? I told you shouldn't have fiddled around with the well. You wouldn't listen. Um, you didn't. <laughs> You didn't say I shouldn't fiddle around at the well. I said we should bolt it and see what we can do. Right, I'm going to stick with this. What have we got? Uh... Okay. Restless Axe, at the start of your turn, you may discard the skill to attack and add two hits. That'll give me an extra. It also has Strike, too. <coughs> I got Resourceful. After you prepare the skill, gain one Inspiration. At the end of your turn, you may discard the skill to gain one Inspiration or Scout one. What do you think? I, I honestly have no frigging clue right now. We're, we're probably two... So look. Two turns away from failing this and thing completely. Yeah. So... I'm we're not going to be able to take this troll down. So should I... Not with 23 and, health. Should I provoke and see if I can smash this mirror with a bit more might? I guess. Um, <laughs> oh, I've got... we got to provoke first. Separately. Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. Was it trying to be terrible? <coughs> In a frenzy, Uluk slashes at you with jagged, well. filthy claws. <sighs> of course, it's agility. <laughs> and that's one of the things that this doesn't help you with. Which is oh, he moves away though. Uh, agility. Yeah, have you got anything? Um. Yeah. yeah. I could use this when a nearby enemy activates. It's not an activation, though, is it? No. Nope. That would be it's in provoking. the shadow phase. Okay. Oh, I should have done that. Oh well. <laughs> ah, that's nothing. So, three wounds and one fear. He does move away though, so that's something. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> I've got to flip this face down. Each nearby hero flips one fear face up, then flip this face down. Face down. <laughs> and then flip this face down, and then my fear. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> uh, greed. Deplete another hero's trinket without resolving its effect. If you cannot suffer one face out fear, then flip this face. Deplete fully? Um, right, when it's deplete, you just take one off. Okay. Okay. Sorry, I'm going to need to heal soon, but I'm going to try and smash the mirror. Okay, after he this attack, move, he moves yeah. one further far away. And also, because I suffered wounds, I gained one inspiration. <clears throat> so I can use it, but... All right, let's try and smash a mirror. Hmm. Okay, <laughs> might. One, two, three, four. Okay. Two successes. You strike it repeatedly, cracks, etc. Gain determination. It's such a pain. I mean, that was your first turn, right? Yeah. 
So you could so do again, so but I could smash it again. But it depends how again? many successes you're going to have in that. But I am determined now. Can mm. I just look through to see how many successes I got? No, probably not. <sighs> I'd just try it again. Do you want? I don't know what else to do. Because this is definitely <laughs> like the objective. Okay. Okay. One, two, three, four, and then I'll use determined. One, two, three, two. Ah, uh, can I? I can't even help. I, I've got literally done nothing to help. Oh! Oh! The shards <coughs> of it scatter across the stone floor. <coughs> one by one, the tall mirrors collapse and shatter after being struck. The wraiths shy back, but solemnly accept your decision. Finally, as you stand in the ruins of the mirror, glass scattered at your feet. The deed is done, and you can see the wraiths no more. With the thing in pieces, you feel certain Atarin will not be able to use it for his grim purpose. Each hero gains one inspiration, then discard the search token. Okay. You have shattered most of it, stealing it from Atarin's grass. The remaining, the remain, the, there remains the piece in the king's vault, and you cannot risk that it is enough for Atarin's purposes. Objective updated. Find the missing piece. Far, from afar, you can see that Ataran's orcs have thoroughly closed off the paths out of Anuminus. Once you've dealt with the mirror, the lake is likely your only chance of escape. Place a search token <coughs> all the way down there. Okay, your turn. <clears throat> So do I just try and get the exploration as much as possible and see what each thing is? So I can okay. hit one, two, one, two. I can clear those three mm. exploration pieces off. I think these and the threats are what adds to the shadow phase thing. So one, two, clear this one, uh, which is that one there. Confirm. An area of ruined foundations marks where a settlement used to be. Gain one inspiration. Something pale on this tree flutters in the breeze. Search token. The journey continues. Is that it? Okay, uh, and I guess I'm just going to do the same as so one and then two. Because we need to find where this vault is. Mm -hmm. So this one. A great oak rises from the ruins of a forgotten outpost. The statue of a regal man stands in what was once a city square. Hmm. Search token. Another statue of a regal man on the other side. They said something about a statue. The spirits did. The wraiths. Um, so, hang on. So let's say I've only moved once for the moment. Okay. You still can't explore. No, I know. I'm just trying to figure out which way is best. Because I can either go here or I can go here. <laughs> I guess the downside is the troll could go two and then start smashing me. If I'm in this one, it might only be able to move two and they won't be able to reach me. Mm -hmm. Maybe. So yeah, let's carry on this way and do this one here. Yep. <coughs> Several makeshift bridges and gates have been trussed to a crumbling ruins. That's me full in inspiration. Nice. <laughs> the only downside is you're going to take that. Less. This structure appears to be the ruins <laughs> of an old stockade. Place a search token. A loose pile of rocks lies on the ground. Ground, something glimmers within. Search token there. A statue of a regal man. Um, still in the city square. <coughs> okay, that's all I got. Okay. Oops. So we both done our turns, yeah? Yep. Hmm. Here we go. Uh, okay. Troll. Yeah. Yeah, so you can. can. <coughs> oh look, Eesh. hammers at your defenses with a fist and chain might negate. Um, yeah. That was not how yeah. I saw that going. I'm gonna die. Two, three. Hang on. Not that it'll help that much. It's fine because you don't die. Die so. Yeah. <laughs> One success, so I would negate three, but then I am going to go into 
last, last stand. stand. So I'll take the one. <laughs> yep. Flip face down. He's gonna. I'm gonna move him away because that's mm -hmm. confirm. Okay. You can't. <laughs> Two spaces towards closest to your own. That technically would be you, wouldn't it? Ichiro in darkness. That's me. So, so two wounds and your spirit negates. <clears throat> that's fine. Okay, two cool. successes. Okay. Only goes up at eight. Uh, so something, but it's going to click to the next. Oh. The last turn. A Tarin, a descendant of those who left Numenor with, and settled far from the realms of Arnor and Gondor, enters the tower's high chamber. The orcs at his beck and call make to secure the ruin. Place a tar in as oh, indicated. Jeez, he's on your square. Where, what does he look like? He's got a helmet, a sword, he's kind of holding it like this. Uh, he's probably gonna, he's gonna be in the bag. Maybe. Have a look in there. This works. Gonna be in the big bag. Look at one of these. Oh, is it this dude? It says Yes. Oh, there we go. In my space, is he? Yes. Okay. More orcs pull from their boat. <coughs> Two pit goblins. Pit goblins. As long as you're dealing with the spears. And they are there. Oof, we're not gonna make it out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, I'll do that and then do my last stand, I guess. Yes. It's damage. Do your scouting first because this can be in order, so. Mm. Ready defense. I'm going to do light footed. I think. Test might. I'll put that at the bottom. One, two, three, four. One success, a pass. Discard all face down wounds, gain one inspiration, and continue. Nice. And my inspiration limit has gone up to four because of my yep. upgraded axe, so that is great. So I'm still exhausted, so I still can't put scouted cards at the top, but. Uh, okay. Maybe we start with you carry on exploring, because if you yeah. find the thing... So which girl am I in? I'm on this one. So what was this one? This was... Loose piles of rock. Something so glimmers. There's a statue there. Two statues there. Yeah. And I mean, something there. glimmers, so that's kind of like saying to me there's something glinting in it. Yeah. But do I go for that, or do I try and go for the statue? I have no idea. <laughs> so that's that one. Um, that's... Statue. Search for the vault. They did say something about a vault, but the statue, the statue yeah. was in a vault, wasn't so it? So you got three uh, the, of those. The... I think we need to find out which of the statues is the king to know if it, the vault's under it. That's because that gave you an option to search, to identify the yeah. king or search for the vault. Same with that one. So I think that's more likely to be, one of those three is more likely to be it, but there might be something here as well, we don't know. So what I could do is... Right, where are we? That one's a king. That one's a statue. Yeah. Okay, so what I could do is move, explore, move, and search. Okay. So I think that's just to see what's in this. We see whether there's a more statue. Yeah, because we've got three on the board at the moment. Ruin has come to these structures. Somehow, only the common well survives intact. I can't get any more exploration. Okay. Uh, inspiration, even. <laughs> the ground before you seems to rise and fall in a pattern. Place a search at <clears> home. <throat> A woman with a squished brown hat is sitting next to a small wagon by the side of the road. You recognise the markings of a merchant about her, but she does not appear wealthy. You get a person token. Okay. There? Yep. The journey continues. Okay, so I'm going to bounce back up here and I'm going to explore or try and. Right, which tile are we on? I've completely lost it. This one? Yeah, that's the one. Uh, identify the king, or do I search for the vault? Um, There's a statue of one of the kings of Arno, though you aren't sure which one yet. It could conceal the king's vault. 
I've got three wisdom, three wit. I feel like we probably need to identify the king first, right? But then we don't know which so. king we need to identify. But, it, yeah. I, I, I would go for identify the king myself, but I don't know. Okay. The statue is clearly <laughs> one of the kings of Arnor, judging by the scepter in his hand. But if there were an inscription to tell you which king, it has been worn away with time. Test wisdom. When you interact with a search or threat token, before you test, you may discard this skill to test agility instead and scout one. So I'm going to scout one. Okay, mm -hmm. and then I'm going to test agility. So I have four. Test. Okay, where's that one card? Last one. One, two, three, four. So you could make it two and pass, or. <laughs> That's a pass. Oh. The king, this king rests one hand on his unsheathed sword, the tip of the sword planted between his feet. Upon close inspection, you are certain that this is King Tarondor, son of Harkil, the seventh king of Arnor. You notice that the base of the statue has a few stones that appear to be movable, though for what purpose, you aren't certain. Seventh king, seven shards. Could that be the, the place with the stones, maybe? Maybe. The statue continues to watch over the ruin. Such a monument may yet play a role in your search for, the, for a tool of long dead kings. Give me. Right. So, Give me these up. I think I've just got to try and get rid of these dudes. So, how much health does a Tarin have? Oh, so much. And as much as the troll. Might be able to, to take out a lot of him, but I don't I know. just try and take him out? I don't know. I, mean, I, honest, I don't know. I can use my inspiration now. <clears throat> yeah, so that's going to help. Um, okay. <laughs> Restless Axe. At the start of your turn, you may discard the skill to attack and add two hits. Okay. So that's that's to give me a bonus attack. So I'm going to attack a Tarin. Yep. This is such a bad idea. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Oh. <laughs> So, I can, I can have extras, yeah. I can, so I could do the two and the one, if I have three successes, right? Uh, I think so. But I can't do two of the twos. Don't quote do me. Each. Might want to check that in the rulebook. I'm pretty sure that was it. I think we looked it up before. <clears throat> each ability can be resolved only once, so I could do. So we've got two hits there. I make it eight, nine, ten. I could do ten hits in yep. this one attack. Okay. Just by spending. Have you got any sunder cleaves, etc.? It would be cleave and sunder. So I'll do that. Go for I'll spend it. two cleave, to make it three. Sunder. How many? Um. So I got six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten. Yes. <laughs> Can he attack? Yes. <laughs> Very much so. Atari speaks a singular ancient word, each <laughs> syllable enunciated meticulously. Your spirit answers its call. So I can negate with spirit. Um, you can't negate seven though. Four. No, I have to take something. I can use ready defense to add an extra success. That's an ongoing thing. <laughs> oh. When a nearby. Oh, it's not an activation! <coughs> Annoying. Okay. One, two, three, four. So I, took, I negate one. So I could negate three things. What do I need to survive? I can take the wounds. Um, I can take a total of four fear. So I need to negate four. Right? Uh, no, I need to negate three fear yeah. to not die. Yeah. So I'm negating one already, yeah. so I'll have to use both my inspirations to yeah. negate two of them. So I take two wounds and one fear. Is that right? So I'm negating three. We You're negating this, three, so one, two, two, one, two, three. Wait. So I'm taking, no. You're negating three ah. fear, which means you're taking two fears oh, and so two wounds. I'm still going to die. I'm still going to go into last stand. That's, uh, so is there any point in even using the inspiration no. at that point? Okay, so I won't do that. I will take... <clears throat> if you suffer, damage. if you suffer fear from this attack, place one weakness on top of your deck. So take all, take oh, everything in order. Do everything in order. So two um, wounds. <clears throat> okay. Are you getting two? Face down. You're negating how many fears? Just the one. Yeah, just the one. Because I might as well negate the wound because my fear is going to go if I pass the final stand. Yeah, but you might get a bunch of face up ones. 
true, I guess. And it only, from what I gather, it only gets rid of the face down fears. Yeah, okay. Mm, face down. <laughs> so I'm taking four fears. But yeah, because you're getting one. So for one face down fear, then like face this fear face down. Do I just stop when it reaches the limit, though? I guess. Okay. I think that's what I did before. But does it place one weakness on top of your deck if you okay. suffer any fears? I need a weakness. <sighs> your mind is breaking and you try to hold it together. Test spirit. <clears throat> one, two, three, four. Spend one, make it a pass. I've got two successes. <laughs> Discard all face down fear. Nice. Gain one inspiration and continue the adventure. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> you going again? <laughs> I need to shuffle my deck because I've yeah, gone yeah. through the whole thing. Um, but I've got my two inspiration. So you're going for a tyrant again? Yeah. I think stopping now would be a response. Yeah, he's got five of 12 with three magic armor, so you need eight um, hits. So you've got two inspirations, so as long as you get, as long as you pull out two leaves at least, yeah. you can do it, right? I need three successes. Oh, three successes. To okay. Get eight hits. Okay, so at least, I mean, if you get one success and two leaves, you're fine. You're Oscar Mike. Ah, oh, God. Okay, we'll do the two, which it makes it six hits and cleave. Can you not do anything else? No. Six? Yep. <clears throat> oh, no. It's because he's a boss, isn't it? <clears throat> a tyrant speaks a singular word, etc. Same one, yeah. It's because he's a boss, right? <laughs> so, spirit negates. One, two, oh, come three, on. four. I got nothing. Um, but I get one success because of using, because of having that prepared. Yeah. The steady. So, I would take the wounds yeah. and negate the one fear. Yeah, because otherwise I'll die! Again. <laughs> and you've got another weakness to place on top of your deck. Face <clears throat> down. So one, two, three, four, five. This is a face down again. <clears throat> and three fears. Yeah. Um, each nearby hero, nope. no one, then put this face down. <laughs> put face down. And put face down. And a weakness. Okay. That's oh, the end. I was hoping that I'd be able to kill him. Yes. Oh, Me well. too, funny enough. close. Yeah, you're nearly there, so. Uh, move okay. zero, there's no one no in there as a target. Oh, God. <laughs> um, move one towards please? Legolas. No, it's this chap. Oh, that guy. So he's just gonna. All closest hero, yeah. so he attacks me. Within range. <laughs> Might negates though, so you got luck when they like might. Mm. <laughs> one, two, three, four, one success. So uh, okay. I will. I, I'm gonna <laughs> yeah. be last standing, but I don't know. Which if you one. suffer any wounds from this attack, you or the Orc Lord move one space toward the closest threat token if possible. So, um, I mean, that would move it off if you'd suffered the wound, otherwise, he stays where he is. Is that good? Because uh, we both move. Again, going back to the thing is, it seems to get rid of all the face down things, so it depends on what you want to get rid of the most. It doesn't make much difference, to be honest. If you're going to go for a Tyrant again and you don't kill him, he's going to slam loads of fear onto you. So I'll take the fear. Okay. Negate the wound. Take the fear. Okay. <coughs> and I guess then I'm not on the same, I'm not losing it. If you are in a space with darkness, <coughs> suffer one fear, then flip this face down while well, I'm already. So, standing, so move nice. these guys towards Legolas. Nope, no target. Uh, move four spaces. One, two, three. Oh, for the love of. Okay. I'm in darkness. in darkness. Yeah. I'm already. Yeah, uh, so. <laughs> have to reset and scout next, don't we? <clears throat> if I can kill a Tarin, I feel like that is yeah. like the end, though. So. Yeah. I feel like you should go next. Because now I've got these two goblins on we'll my see space. see if I succeed on the last stand for fear first, because this is a, it's a bit risky. Hmm. Honda agility. When you test agility, you may discard the skill to add one success. Yes, I'll, I'll, I'll put that there. I've either got my haunted um, weakness or 
ancient wisdom, when you test wisdom, uh, you can discard this to add one success. Let's do your... Was it fear? Fear, yeah. It's gonna be bad. Oh, shh. Three. Your mind is breaking. You try to hold it together. <coughs> test. Three. The spirit. So I got four right now. I fail. Oh, God. There's nothing I can do there. You have fallen. Remove your figure from the map. At the start of the next shadow phase, you will fail this adventure. I'm down. I'm out. <laughs> so if you can get here and attack Atari, maybe. I don't know what else. I feel like at this point, you've literally got your one turn to, to win. That I feel like is the most likely. Thing Wait, hang on, to hang on, hang on. Let me think. Let me think. So I need to get off this square with these goblins too. Mm. So okay, let me provoke these guys. <clears throat> okay, the goblin tracks your movements with flat, angry eyes. You can negate with wisdom. <sighs> I wish I hadn't drawn that. Damn it! I should have just taken it. But then you can't. You've got to draw them with you. So um, I will take a wound. Isn't there only one success there? No, I do. Oh, okay. two. Oops. Discard one inspiration. Then flip this card face down. I think I've just dropped my thing. So I'm going to move one towards a tar end. Oh, God, this is such a bad move. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to attack a tar end from range. So I've got. It's an agility test, so when you test agility, you may discard this skill to add one success. When you attack, if there are no nearby heroes, add two hits. Yep. Okay. That's not a discard one either. So I got one success there. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then I can do two successes there, which give me seven hits with cleave. Plus the two hits that? Yeah. The nine hits with cleave. <sighs> I'm hoping this does end it. <laughs> <coughs> Remove a tarring. Gain an inspiration. You deal what must have been a mortal blow, even to a Numenorian, <laughs> and a tarin stumbles back. His hand goes to the wound as if to staunch the blood, but then comes away. His blood glows in the darkness, and he stands perhaps even taller than before the battle began. He turns away, and orcs fire arrows to cover his retreat. All heroes gain one inspiration. I've gained uh, mine. You get another one. I've just I gained it because I used both, so I've already pulled one up. You pulled. You got one for him leaving. <laughs> yeah. This was a separate one for that bit of text. Oh, okay. Choose one hero to gain the title <laughs> Lord Mas Law Master. Okay. <laughs> oh, damn it, that did not end it. Oh. Before you test, you may remove this skill from the adventure to scout five. Damn, dude. Yeah, well, uh, it's game over, right? <clears throat> Don't move anywhere. You've got one move left. I don't know. Oh, I'm sad. It's game over, man. Game over. Tarrant's orcs are everywhere. You slay a few of them and avoid others, but soon you find yourself surrounded. You hear drums approaching as orcs line you up and force you to your knees. A row of goblins parts and the sorcerer Atarin strides towards you. His clothes are ragged, but his eyes are clear and predatory. Behind him, several burly orcs drag a tall mirror, a single component of the mirror. The wraith world sliding across its face. How often man repeats the mistakes of Numenor, he says, pacing before you. He even draws, and even draws elf and dwarf into their blunder. At least you will now have a chance to serve a nobler cause. He draws the silent scepter from his belt and whirls, speaking sharp words, and his orcs plant at the piece of the mirror in the ground, holding it upright. The wind picks up and the rain lashes, and goblins beat drums in anticipation. Atarin points the scepter at the mirror. I am Atarin. I wield the symbol of the kings of Arnor, and you will heed my command. 
the wind intensifies to a buffer buffeting a gale, and the sky itself appears to flicker like struggling lantern light. All around you, wraiths began to begin to appear, wraiths old and young and fearful and armed, all heeding Atarin's words. This is his army. You feel cold, ethereal blades pass through you, and then nothing more. The heroes have lost. The campaign ends here. Wow. That sucked. Yeah. <clears throat> As the mists creep in on the heels of night, many can sense the doom that is coming for Heliodor. The elves note the darkening of the stars. The dwarves in their halls hear the echoes of drum. Atarin and his forces of the undead have no equal among the armies of Middle-earth. With his dark powers, terrifying allies, and a newly forged army of undying whites, Atarin means to cement his rule over every living thing. And without heroes to stop him, hope seems a far and dim thing, out of reach. And in the land of Mordor, where the shadows lie, a great enemy watches and laughs. Well, oh. the end. It did feel a little bit like hopeless, though, didn't it? It really did. Um, um. <laughs> yeah, all right. Well, that's that. <laughs> Do you know how many success you've actually yeah. got? It's a good shout. Five successes out of one, two, three. Twenty cards. So that includes two weaknesses. Twenty-two cards, I have five successes. It doesn't feel like enough. And maybe we could have been smarter with um, leveling up with the upgraded cards and maybe, stuff. Maybe. Maybe. <sighs> wow. That. Wow. Aw. Okay. Nothing All right. Mind. Yeah. Well. So are there, there's more campaigns. Yes. Right? Yeah, yeah. 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 So if I hit new game, um, there's We've the done, Bones of Arnor. Failed Bones of Arnor. There's Hunt for the Ember Crown, which we haven't got yet. There's Shadowed Paths, which is, I believe, Moria. Yes, Moria. Mm -hmm. Hunt Haunting of Dale, which we don't have yet. Uh, Spreading War, which is one we do have, and Poison Promise, which we don't have yet. There is. I'm uh, kind of wondering because there is the other expansion with the Witch King and that, so I'm not sure what's going on with that. So yeah, I'm talking into that. Might, like, we've, we've added them, saying that we've got them. Yeah, so maybe they just add the different characters on. Yeah. Because obviously the foul beasts, well, the foul beasts come from there. So yeah, we'll, we'll mm -hmm. see where we go with that, but yeah. Well, that one's disappointing. I'd... Maybe we return to this one. Yeah. So point. maybe we need to play two characters each instead. Maybe. Like we do in Marvel United. But I'm sure it would probably, I imagine it would scale. <laughs> I don't know, but, but it would give us more time to be able to do stuff. But we've only got two of these boards. Eh, we'll make it work. <laughs> we'll make it work. Um, yeah, I mean, having more actions, it feels like you've got more opportunity to do the exploration and find things yeah. without running out of time immediately. Yeah. We'd have to see. What? Do you, any thoughts on if you'd want to just do this one again from the start with I, what we know? I think or... we should move on to the next one, otherwise yeah. it'll be a bit too repetitive mm. straight off the bat. So I, I think, think it, it do does another sort one of... first. Some of the stuff is procedurally generated, yeah. of course, but the, the story itself would be the same. I'd imagine so, yeah. Yeah, do, we'll do a different campaign at some point. Um, <clears throat> oh, Gimli, you let us down. And Legolas. I, I do feel like it, it just felt like it was impossible from the start of this one. Yeah. And maybe if we'd <clears throat> won some of the earlier ones, maybe it would have made it easier. Yeah, maybe. But even the earlier campaigns, it, it did just feel a bit off balance, <clears throat> a little bit, maybe. Maybe we're just being rubbish. Maybe. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway. If you played this game before and had a bit more success, let us know if like the strategies that mm. um, seem to work better for you than what we tried. We both have different play styles with a lot of games, so yeah. um, you're a lot more cautious than I am, obviously. <laughs> And sometimes it pays off, and sometimes the exploration think, pays off. It's hard to balance. I think, yeah, sometimes I think I feel like, especially with this one, I feel I was like, right, we need to focus on this. But then you're like, oh, look, there's some flowers on the well. Oh, well, um, I thought the well could lead to like a secret place that might actually hail something. Mm. That's my thinking. But, oh, well. Well, well. 
Anyway, take so. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching us lose. <laughs> yeah, we appreciate you. Wow, Always. nice way to put it. Please like this video if you liked it, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell to be notified when we drop new videos. Um, talk to us on socials, our link tree is in the description below and that will take you to Instagram, Facebook and Twitter. You can talk to us there or in the comments about your experiences with this game, what you might have done differently, um, or if you have a, a favourite expansion that you'd like to see us try the campaign for next, otherwise we'll probably go in order, so if you have a preference let us know. Um, I think that's about it. Yeah. Yeah? Cool. cool. Until next time, don't get killed by a tyrant. Bye! <laughs>